We are definitely in love. Yeah, she's just an amazing sort. Um, yeah, look, I've I've already lost my job as a direct oh, result God. of this show. Oh. Rachel, you set this for us. Hello, fellow couch potatoes. Welcome to my channel. Let's get to today's video. Speaking to Hugsy, Ed and Erin, Jackson was asked what he loves about Liv. Look, it's it's so difficult because it's literally been so hard to watch because like if that was a person who Liv was, then we wouldn't be together. And for me, like Liv is actually such a beautiful person and she is so nice and she's so caring and like she'd do anything for anyone and friends, family and she's proved that multiple times to my friends and family and yeah, she's just an amazing soul. Yeah. Hugh C asked Jackson if he would slap Married at First Sight editors if it was illegal, and this is what Jackson had to say. I'd give it a real big Will Smith, Chris Rock vibe. <laughs> wow. Because <laughs> well, wow, he's that. protecting his woman. Yeah. Oh, goodness me. On Mavs, Liv mentioned time and time again how she holds a grudge. However, she contradicts herself as she mentions conflict isn't part of her character during the interview. The sort of conflict I have like is very um, not in my character, so it just eats, eats, eats me away. Olivia also said she feels more hated than Vladimir Putin because of how many people have demanded her to face criminal charges for circulating... A naked photo of another contestant. That contestant is Dominica, of course. Like I saw that change.org petition and it's like, oh my God, more people. Yeah, like more people have signed a petition to have me arrested or something <laughs> than <laughs> like to end the war in Ukraine. So it's, in Australia, I feel like yeah, I'm more hated it's... than Vladimir Putin. But you've... That's sheer insanity. I'm out. Olivia was asked to give an example of the hate she has received and this is what she had to say. Um, a lady came up to me, I was at a bar with Tamara and a lady came up to me with a wine glass and was like, if I, sh if I smash this, will I get a reaction? Oh my God. Oh, right, yeah. people of Sydney, if you're, if you're listening. What the hell did you just say? With what she said, do you believe she's getting a plethora of like terrible hate? I don't think so, but hey, I don't know. Olivia then revealed she lost her job as a result of her time on Married at First Sight. Um, yeah, look, I've, I've already lost my job as a direct result of this show. Oh. Not her actions, but just being on the show. It's the show, of course. Olivia's response to losing her job on the show prompted the host to ask her if she had any regrets for going on the show, and this is what she had to say. Look, I've got some beautiful girlfriends from it, um, so I, I don't. Hard to pay, I don't, hard to pay, I don't. So Olivia still has no regrets for her actions and blames the edit for how she was portrayed. No accountability and couch potatoes. That's all I have for you today. Until next time, see you soon. Hey Couch Potato, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. See you soon.